Hi guys, Steve716 here. So welcome back to my channel and uh, just gonna show you what I've actually done today on the bike. Well, it hasn't took me all day, it's took me like um, 20, 20, 25 minutes, something like that, 20 minutes, half an hour. I've, um, I've entered the 21st century and uh, because I've been moaned at, I'm now holding my phone in landscape mode and not portrait. So uh, hopefully you'll be able to uh, see a little bit more of uh, what's going on here on my videos. But uh, anyway, it's enough of that. I'm gonna uh, flip the camera around and uh, show you exactly what I've done um, on this uh, the, this uh, Chinese uh, clone stealth bomber. And um, yeah, and uh, show you what I've picked up for a really cheap price today, this uh, chain ring. So yeah, guys, this is what I've done today. I've put this 52, it's a 52 tooth chain ring and it's a Shimano and it's really lightweight compared to the uh, original one on there which actually weighed a ton to be honest with you. So this one's a 52 tooth and the one that come on it was a 46 tooth. So it's, it's a considerable amount of difference, you know, it's not six teeth on there. And um, I mean, with the original one which was on here, which is really fat, and heavy um, pedaling tops 16 17 maybe 18 mile an hour my legs were going 10 to the dozen I'll tell you at that speed so that's no good for pedal assist to be honest with you. not on one of these uh, high high powered uh, e-bikes you need something a bit more substantial 52 minimum to be honest with you but um, so now with um, this uh, new one which I put on today uh, really really simple job guys absolutely simple you know you've got a matter of a few allen keys here you know you've got five of them basically just take them off uh, take your chain run your chain off and uh, just remove it it just slides off and then uh, slide your new one on and do them up it's as simple as that it's, it's really uh, schoolboy stuff guys um, obviously now I've got the big, bigger chain ring on the front the, I just managed to get away with the chain to be honest with you. I mean, it, it's, it's, it's a little bit tight for my likings. It's not too bad, but I think I'll just get away with it. So, um, I mean, it had this chain. Obviously, I don't, I've got no need for this now. Obviously, when it had the 46 tooth on there, it needed this to take the slackness out of the chain, but now, I do not need this because there's like hardly any slackness in the chain at all now. Um, yeah, so now with this 52 tooth, I should be good for 25, 26 miles an hour pedaling comfortably, you know, and it should maybe take me up slightly higher, but then your legs are going to go, will be going 10 to the dozen again. So, um, but I like to cruise along at 21, 22 mile an hour in level assist free, which takes you to around that speed. And my legs are going nicely. Do you know what I mean? Not like a lunatic. So um, yeah, that's what it is. And I, I got this uh, second hand from a local bike shop. So I was extremely lucky because generally they don't always have a higher tooth uh, chain rings in stock to be honest with you, you might have to get one offline and then wait a few days but I'm, I've got no patience whatsoever and I just want it like yesterday so yeah and I paid three pounds for it so it was you know like five dollars absolute bargain I mean it's, it's a Shimano as well so yeah not bad it's probably the um, best best made bit on the whole bike to be honest with you but uh, there you go so um, I'm chuffed with that I haven't actually tested it yet and um, let's get some light on the subject. So I haven't actually tested it yet. I'm hoping to within the next couple of days, but I've been there before. I've had a 52 tooth before, and I sort of know what to expect on, on a 52 tooth. And uh, I know it's a lot more pleasurable in pedal assist with one of these on, it really is. And uh, as you can see, the bike's look, looking um, pretty damn sweet, to be honest with you. I'm uh, really, really chuffed with it. 
So there it is guys, just a another brief video from me. It's just to show what I've been getting on, on with with the, uh, the recent purchase. Obviously it was out and I'm, I'm really, really, really chuffed with the bike at the minute. I'm just tidying up a few little bits on it and um, to make it a lot more usable as far as, far as I'm concerned. Um, obviously you don't really pedal too much when you're off-road anyway, but when I'm on road, I like to pedal. I like to keep the speed down and um, look like a cyclist if you know what i'm saying <laughs> but um yeah anyway well thanks for watching my video guys really appreciate it and uh i'll see you on the next one and keep safe